Welcome back to the channel. In this video, I will test again my generator made with overboard motor. I want to try a new Pelton wheel with soft spoon. I need to 3D print 14 spoons and it takes 1 hour 15 minutes each, even with 0.28mm layer height. With that resolution, it makes the surface really rough, especially because it needs supports. So after a few research and investment, I started to make the spoon with polyurethane resin. I'll make a video of the process soon. I basically 3D printed with resin printer one spoon and made a silicone mold out of it, and then pour polyurethane inside. The result is very impressive. I want to inform you that I'll update the file soon, because I changed a few things on the Pelton spoon, making it easier to print and to resin cast. This segment of the video is the installation before some tests. Feel free to skip this part if you have no time for it. For some reason, I lost 5 watt from the previous test, using the exact same setup. I get around 75 watt with the 3D printed wheel. By the way, if you have ideas on how to improve the generator, feel free to comment or join the Discord group. If you are not yet subscribed, I'd really appreciate what you do to support my work, thank you. I wasn't expecting to get 26% more power using soft spoons. It's definitely worth it, but don't get me wrong, it doesn't mean that you can't get good efficiency with FDM 3D printed spoons. You just need to lower the layer height to for example 0.1mm. But with my settings, it would take 3 hours and 15 minutes per spoon. If it's for personal use, you can be patient and use 3D printer and even use sandpaper to make the surface soft. This last video segment is for those who wonder why I produce 95 watts and not 300 watts, like in my other video with the washing machine generator. Basically, to test the overboard generator, I use a 2-inch pipe, and for my stable hydro generator, I use a 4-inch pipe with homemade aluminum pelton wheel. If you are interested in making your own aluminum pelton, check my other videos. Thank you for watching.